Hello, and welcome to Captured, a demo downloaded from Steam. The full game is due to be released on the 15th of this month, which is October. Yeah, it's spooky season at the moment, so everybody's playing horror games, including me. I play them all year round, because I'm a bad man. Let's go. Oh, we got difficulty options here. Safe house, I don't know about that. All deadly creatures are removed. Nah. Let's go with normal. Object type anomalies only affect large objects, furniture, and appliances. The number of required anomalies has been reduced in the demo. Okay, let's go for that one. Okay, uh, recording. So this is uh, how my room looks normally, but... <clears throat> there, do you see it? Oh yeah, I, I see the eyes uh, there. I think it's hard to see on camera. Yeah, they're and not there, with the light on. It's nothing there when the lights are on. Let me try this. There it is again. So. Yeah, I don't know. It's like it hates lights or something. What? What was that? Wait, where's the light switch? Mom? What? Oh, now we're in? I didn't expect that. I thought we were going to get a full-on intro there. Then something would happen, it would cut away. And then it will go to a different person or something, I don't know. So I've got to hold left mouse button to grab and push doors. Hold that to zoom. Then toggle the flashlight and shift to sprint. Okay, let's... Oh, I can't open that door. Okay. So why did he run up here then? It's very nice looking, very clean. It feels nice as well. And it's very spooky. Where's the face on that person? What the hell? Yes, okay, you, you've told me that. They're down there in the right bottom corner. Something seems off. All windows and ceiling lights are gone. Explore the house and get familiar with each room. Try to memorize the furniture and large objects. Oh, shoot. There's a lot to memorize. But it's telling me to memorise the furniture and large objects. So let's keep that in mind. Uh-huh. Mm hmm Ooh. I'm not sure what console that is. It does say there, I think. Another door here, partially opened. What did that say? Bit of dialogue come up at the bottom, I don't know why. So we are looking for anomalies in this one. It's hard to look for anomalies in this kind of atmosphere. It's a little bit spooky. Has me a little bit on edge. Will I be looping soon? I like the torch, by the way, how it moves. It's perfect. Right, okay. I think that's what came up earlier, for a split second. I've just got to keep reminding me about that. Am I really supposed to memorise all of the furniture in these rooms? There's a lot. That shadow is creepy there. Light switches. This is some ball right here. What is this? Hmm. 
hmm, I've got to the point now where I don't even want to try to memorise it all. It's just too much. Fair enough if it's one or two rooms. I mean, Dark Discoveries, did it, you know, it was borderline with them. But they did a perfect job of the anomalies. It wasn't furniture that was changing, it was stuff just appearing in the rooms now and then. And events would happen. So they nailed it, but let's see what these guys are up to here. Whoa. Zoom on an anomaly and use the left mouse button to capture it. Then press E and select the correct anomaly type. So we have looped. We've got to go all the way back around now and check everything again. So I think there's threats in this game when it's on normal mode. Oh shit. I think that's an anomaly. Oh, shoot. Can I just... If you spot an anomaly, you need to stand within the same room to scan it, really? You need to make me go in there? Scan! Yeah, we've got one. Select anomaly. Object, electronic, lighting, water, missing room, deformed room. What would you say? Lighting? Right, we've got red light in here, so it's, it's lighting. You have locked in your selection successfully. Your selections are confirmed every time you exit a loop. So, successfully, does that mean I was right? Hope so. Scanning for anomalies drains your battery. Look around the house for new batteries. Batteries, entities and other collectibles do not count as anomalies. So we can find batteries? Is it just the one anomaly? The anomaly counter shows the amount of captured anomalies. To escape, your counter has to reach six captured anomalies. Each loop can have up to four anomalies. What? So there's potentially four anomalies here? We got that one. Do I need to check all the other rooms then? Oh damn. Let's check this one then. Now. I don't know who that was asking if I was lost. Very creepy voice. Nothing out of the ordinary there. I have a feeling I'm going to find another one, you know, in this loop here. Mm, everything seems the same there, I think. Oh, we, we need to keep an eye on that, definitely. Kitchen. It's all gravy. Let's move on. Dining room, again. I can't remember, actually. I don't even know what if anything's changed. I'd imagine it would be obvious, like the red room back there. Surely. Surely. I don't like this big room here. This living room area. There's a weird feeling in here. Don't know why. What happens if I just scan a room randomly? No anomalies within range, right? Or I do need to keep finding batteries. Maybe so I can do that in every room? But would that take the phone out of it? I don't know. I kind of like finding them with my own eyes. Exiting a loop confirms you captured anomalies. 
Missing or incorrectly selecting an anomaly will reset your anom counter after entering a new loop. I don't think it did, you know. I'm pretty sure that was on 01, 06, just. I think there was more than one anomaly. That's some bullshit. If that's the case, anyway. Whoa! Okay. Number not lose. What? Are you kidding me? Has it gone? Oh, I, d I don't want to turn around. It's gone right. Oh my god. I mean, I thought scanning while looking away would work. I was in the same corridor as it, so... You know? That was a bit scary right there. Wherever it was had a smiley face, and it was very tall. Nothing in there. Something happened there. The game twitched. Usually means something happened. So, my battery doesn't go back up then when I go through a loop. I need to start finding some batteries. Oh, Just as I say it, there they are. I'm going to scan this room, just for a laugh. No anomalies within range. So that's used the bar on my battery. Attention. If you are watching this, you may be stuck in a loop. If your house feels unfamiliar, you may be stuck in a loop. If all ceiling lights and windows are gone, you may be stuck in a loop. If none of these apply, terminate this message immediately. The following information is highly confidential. It seems your only means of communication with the outside world is through your video camera. We can view your recordings just as you can view this broadcast. As you have likely noticed, each time you enter a new loop, there are small changes in your house. Do not overlook any anomalies and make sure to capture them on camera. Thank you. For the help. Jeez, man. I love how it's outlined with a square because I've marked it as an anomaly. <laughs> Gonna keep looking around here. Oh, oh, damn. I didn't realise that was the end of the loop. But it's gone back up to 0106. That must have been the only one. So, we've done good. I don't remember that light being on there before. There's no electricity here. Ain't even any light switches, so... Why is this on? Whoa. Got awfully twitchy there. Oh, I, don't, I don't know if I should try and put that as an anomaly. Let's go down here first, see if anything happens. Checking the rooms. I heard that. I heard that bang. Why is this open? Was it always open? I don't know. Why are these lights on? Do I report this? Oh. Right, so it has detected one. I'm gonna go with lighting. Yeah, I'm going with lighting. Let's confirm. Lighting. What else? There's something else, isn't there? Let's just walk into the rooms. It may trigger something. You know, we can't just open the door, look at the room and move on. Which reminds me, I missed a room back there that I didn't actually go in. 
I just looked in there, didn't I? Like this, see yeah. Oh, bat batteries. What was that? Keep hearing weird sounds. Like somebody running around? That still looks the same. I keep forgetting about that, actually. It's only the second time I've tried that. That isn't right. That is not right. There's a bloody tree in the middle of the kitchen. Um, what do I go with here? Object or deformed room? I'm going to go with object. Because, it, you know, an object... A tree is an object, right? It's not only that, but I think it's a bloody Christmas tree. Without the decorations. So I'm glad I looked in there. That's... That's two anomalies in one loop. Right there. Let's move through the living room. And hopefully I'm right. Yes, three. I am. I don't know who said that though. I appreciate the encouragement though. Really do. Not seeing anything happening with that clock yet. The game is very twitchy at the moment. Not sure why that suddenly happened. Like I said though, it could just be my mouse. It is a bit broken, I think. Again, some strange sounds. Like there's somebody else just walking around in here. I see a light on in here again, and a tree. What? Oh. We're actually outside? Should we report this now? Right, now. Missing room. It has to be. I mean, this itself is not a room, is it? It's outside. But I need to go and investigate. I can't just leave it at that. It's definitely a deformed room. Who the fuck was that? What's going on here? Place for me to sit down. More batteries. Nice. I don't think I report this, do I? No, I just came here for the batteries, right? Let's go back. If we, we can. It's a good job they put that red light there. I never would have found my way back, I don't think. I heard that. Why is the door shut now? Who's that? Go. Let's close that door now. We're done with that area. Let's close the door. Whew. Right. Let's see what else we can find. Can we flush the toilet? Nope. It doesn't matter. An anomaly around here anywhere? No, I think that's it. I hope that's it anyway, or else we're going back to zero here. I have a bad feeling about this. Let's go through, though. Oh, it's gone to zero. If a room's door is missing, it is considered a missing room anomaly. Yeah, that's what I put. Yeah, I feel like that thing that came up was telling me that I put the wrong one. On the, the missing room, or the deformed room, I don't know. Oop, that ain't right. The toilets are playing chess. It's great, actually. What am I going to go with here? Object or deformed room? I'm going to go with object. It's just an object in the wrong place. So weird. No batteries. So that's one anomaly we've got. Hmm. 
Nothing in there. Oh, batteries. Yes. I don't see anything different. What about you? No. <laughs> That's different. Another object moving. I reckon two in this loop and that's it. I do like how there's more than one anomaly per loop. There can be more happening in the game because of some of the previous anomaly hunting games that I've played. I do get to a point sometimes where I'm, I'm not seeing any anomalies and it gets a little bit boring. I wouldn't say boring, it just gets a little bit tedious. Because you have to keep checking the same rooms over and over. Let's go through and see if I was right with two. I was. Let's go. See if I can get back to four here. Hello? Give me something cool and obvious. Wait. I don't remember seeing that there before. I'm wrong. Yeah, I knew I was. Damn. I really don't remember seeing that. Ah! Shit. He's back again. I didn't look for too long. scared me that much I sort of slapped the keyboard and pressed F. It's gone. Okay. So that is the threat I think. Try not to look at that shit. Let's go to the next room. Woohoo. Got a whole congregation of chairs here. Another object one. Surely. That's three anomalies in this run, since I failed with the deformed room, or missing room. Either that or there was another anomaly in that loop, and I missed it, which is more than likely, I think. Let's go through. Yes, we were right. We were right. Oh damn, TV's on. Okay, well, can we play some ZX Spectrum? Oh! Let's put that in. Electronic. I like this one. Really do. I was hoping to see more anomaly games like this. Of course they are very good. But like I said earlier, the main thing I like about this one is more than one anomaly per loop. That's a winner right there for me. But at the same time it makes it more difficult. Which could be a good thing, there's more batteries. If a game is more challenging, you're more likely to play it for longer. In my opinion. Come on now, we want more anomalies. Open the bloody door, dude. Not seeing much in here. Have I had any anomalies in this room yet? Don't think I have. Let's scan it for a laugh. Nothing. Not even that dude. It will be a dude eventually, I think. 
There's toilets at the dining room table. Let's scan. I put this as objects. Five of six. We're almost done here for the demo. I almost don't want to find the sixth one. Just so I can keep playing for longer. Tempted to go straight through, but I feel like that will reset it. I do want to keep playing for longer, but at the same time, I might get frustrated if I don't beat it early and I keep getting it wrong. You know what? Let's go through. Uh, pray. Pray. Yes. I'm starting to think in this one there is an, an anomaly every time. At least one. Which is fun. Like I said, more happening in this one. Was that there before? It was. Best to think about this one as well. If, you, if you've got a little sneaky suspicion about something, you scan it, and it says no anomaly, then you know you're wrong. It didn't change like you thought. Oh, it's giving me the tree again. Outside. Is it the same though? They might change it, I don't know. Let's go down there anyway and get my batteries if I can. So what did I put before? Missing room or deformed room? I think I put missing room before. You know what, I'm gonna go for deformed room. Deformed room. It says six of six now. Just the old radio still. With some batteries. I don't know who this guy is here. Are you an anomaly? No, I can't scan anymore. We're still in the same room, you see. So yeah. It's either deformed room or missing room. The breathing is weird when you start running, man. Hear the same noise again on the way back on the left side. Does that mean I've won? I should have won. Because I'm scared? Why do you think? You silly bastard. I'm going! Fuck out of here, dude! No! No! What the fuck is that? Wow, he was already on me when I turned around. <laughs> Captured. A game by Puck Redflix. Thank you for playing the demo. If you enjoyed it, consider adding Captured to your Steam wishlist. Wishlisting the game helps increase its visibility on Steam and will notify you when the full game is released. The full version includes over 90 unique anomalies, fully procedural loops, four difficulties, and even more deadly entities. Wow, 90 unique anomalies. I am looking forward to a full game on this one. I do want to see some of them. Anyway, that's it for the demo, everyone. Thank you all for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Leave a like if you did. Subscribe if you're new around here. And I'll see you all next time.